I was born in Shreveport, Louisiana, grew up here, uh, went to C.E. Bird High School. I then went to LSU for undergrad and came back to Shreveport for med school. I finished med school in 2015 and went to Vanderbilt for my internal medicine residency, stayed at Vanderbilt for general cardiology fellowship, and then did an advanced fellowship in advanced cardiac imaging at Vanderbilt. I am trained in general cardiology and advanced cardiac imaging. My um, particular interest is in valvular heart disease, and that's really why I went into imaging, because I felt like I needed to have those tools to be able to really understand valvular heart disease and be able to make a difference in those patients' lives. So I am particularly focused in advanced echocardiography, transesophageal echo, and cardiac MRI. And so I like to say I get to take pretty pictures of the heart all day. As I was looking for jobs, what impressed me about the Willis-Knighton system was A, the patient care that they provide. Their reputation in this area is stellar. B, I felt like they were really interested in innovating and making sure that they had all the newest technologies to be prepared to care for patients. And as the newer transcatheter valve therapies are developing, there's a bigger and bigger need for people who know how to image those valves and plan for these procedures, and that's really where I come in. So I felt like there was a good opportunity for me to step in and really contribute to the care of the patients in this area um, and provide a service that no one else around really provides through advanced echocardiography and cardiac MRI. I'd like consulting physicians to know that they can send their patient to me for another opinion and I will work with the consulting cardiologist to come up with the best plan for that patient. I'm happy to see patients either at the main medical campus or in the Piermont area, um, would perform any diagnostic services necessary, imaging procedures necessary to get an answer for that physician and that patient, and we could come up with a plan together um, to meet the goals of the physician and the patient. And once I was complete with the imaging procedures, that patient would return to the original consulting physician for further care. I am trained as a general cardiologist and then did an advanced fellowship in advanced cardiac imaging. And so I am truly a multimodality cardiac imager. I am trained in nuclear cardiology, in cardiac CT, and my specific focus is in advanced echocardiography and cardiac MRI. And I feel that the benefit of that is I understand all of these different imaging modalities and how to tailor a not not only treatment plan, but how are we going to get to the diagnosis plan for each patient. So a patient may require an echo and a cardiac MRI, or a patient may require an advanced transesophageal echo. Um, it may be that a patient comes and needs to understand better why they're having chest pain and they've had a cath and the cath didn't reveal anything they might need a cardiac MRI. So I feel that the benefit of my training is that I really understand general cardiology, but also have this advanced knowledge of cardiac imaging modalities and which modality is best suited for which pathology to better understand how to treat that pathology to help a patient feel better and reach his or her goals. For me, the biggest motivator for getting up and going to work every morning is to be able to help patients reach the goals that they have, whatever those goals may be. Whether it's, I wanna be able to walk down to my mailbox and not have chest pain, or I want to be able to go to the lake and play with my grandkids, whatever that is, my goal is to help the patient get there. And having patients come and say, I was really worried that I was never going to get to do this thing that I loved again, and now I feel great. That really keeps me going, and it's why I do what I do.